Well, the Sioux Falls Regional Airport may temporarily put the brakes on a proposed multi million dollar parking ramp. Airport leaders have been considering a parking garage for their 2021 capital project, which could cost about $25 million. The initial plan calls for four levels in the front of the terminal, which could add around 1,100 spots. However, as Kelloland's Brady Mallory reports, how you're getting to and from the airport could be impacting these plans. To get a lift home in South Dakota, Zach Degelow is waiting for his mom. To get to the airport in Colorado, he says he paid a small price for a lift. I would actually be using that right now to get back home if uh, my mom was not here. When mom isn't around, Degelow says Lyft or Uber take care of him. A lot of people use it, so uh, it, it, it's a lot easier than, than parking, for instance. However, the executive director of the Sioux Falls Regional Airport says Lyft isn't exactly uplifting for parking revenues. You know, it's concerning. Depending on where you park here, you'll pay a dollar for an hour or seven to fourteen dollars per day. Since Lyft came to town, Dan Lettler says each day about forty to fifty people use that instead of parking at the airport. That reduces parking profit by two percent, which comes to a loss of more than one hundred thousand dollars per year. So that's our uh, single largest um, uh, revenue source to operate the airport. In 2017, Lettler said the airport was looking at a four level parking garage for 2021 to alleviate crowded parking lots. He says he's going to recommend the airport authority board push that back another year. One, to give us a little better handle on the impacts of lift and our parking needs. You know, that um, in three years, maybe that size of that parking garage is uh, maybe it's a little bit smaller. Degelow says it's good to be flexible because he doesn't see passengers giving up Lyft anytime soon. As Sioux Falls grows and, you know, in general, it's just going to go up. Butler says that he hopes to see construction begin on a ramp by 2022.